Now, we begin. Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Dirty Mobs, and I am here today to bring you a Nasus matchup. One of the ones I get asked about a lot, so hopefully I can show you all some, some things and stuff that will help you out in your game. This one's running Unsealed Public. I'm not sure if that's normal. It did get nerfed today, actually. Um, I think it's actually kind of normal on Nasus. Um, he also... He may go Emax and build a little bit of AP early. That's really obnoxious if they do that, because they just kind of wave clear and just spam wave clear on you, and you kind of get poked down. But we'll see what happens. Early on, it's, you know, literally always the same. It's literally every game. It's Beach Hill, get the minions to push into you, get into this tunnel play area, don't get ganked by Volley Bear. Yeah, like this. Uh, I should have flashed. So, the moral of that story is flash early and often. Basically, I shouldn't have taken that bad trade. I should have. I kind of greeted. I should have known that if I got hit by Volley Bear there, I was going to take such a like bad trade. But it's better to just flash early. God, this is so unbelievably uh, cringe, to say the least. We're just get, trying to get the three at this point. I'm not surprised that he tried to return gank me. I was really watching for that. Nice. Okay, it's in turret range. It's really important because I don't think we kill this without the turret help. I mean, look, we hardly kill it. It's so crazy. We lost cannon. That's okay. So yeah, now we just kind of chill out here. Garner should know I have no prior top. I mean, Volibear pretty much just cheesed me twice. This to clear the minions. I should have queued towards this one, but that's okay. Alright, a lot of people ask, like, what do I do about him stacking off of my, um, my tentacles? There's not really any tricks to it. I mean, I, I don't, it's not something I think about too often, to be, to be honest. I'm gonna keep being careful. He might be, like, he might have, like, gone into a bush to, like, cheese me again. So I'm just gonna be very careful. This is the most dangerous part of the lane, alright? Pre-6, no flash. I kind of want to walk out to kind of test, like, Nasus here. It doesn't seem like Nasus really was, like, going for anything. Because I walked up towards the minion like I was going to go, I said it a few times, and he didn't do anything. Now, I looked at the minion, I looked at my scoreboard there. Uh, and that's because I was looking for this question mark. Because there's fighting going on bot, and sometimes you can't really see. If you go back and watch, you can't really see, like, all the heads here. They kind of can get covered up. So, like, what I'll do is I'll see if that, that missing... Ping is there. Oh, see, we see Volibear. So now I know he's bottom. So I can, like, actually start walking up. And this is gonna push. And we're gonna, like, just slowly push this in over the next minute or so. Start proccing grass for a little bit. We're a little bit low on mana. This, like, early lane, we would have had a lot more, like, pressure if it weren't for Volibear. But Volibear, like, choosing us means that he's not choosing our team. Or, like, we gathered a lot of info on that, right? Like, we know he was top for a while. Actually, I'm gonna wait one more. Just one more, in real quick. Let's get a little more gold on us. Now we're almost level six. That's when this thing's gonna start taking off, right? It's when we look for like one v twos, because we one v two them pretty easily. They have a lot of damage output, but. As long as we hit our E's, we should be okay. I'm gonna go Black Cleaver first. This wouldn't be a bad game for Man Immune, um, honestly. But I'm gonna I'm gonna stick to Black Cleaver here. I can teleport aggressively because we're just one minion away. Oh, if he thinks to get that off, that's uh, cute, my dude. Okay, so he greeted really hard here. Because like now he has no pressure to really do anything. My goal is to just keep back stopping his backs, honestly. Try to keep this, like, gold advantage I have, because I've actually spent my gold, as long as I can. Flyver's bottom. Yeah, practice. Nah, rip. The, the potion, at least, will stop him a little bit longer. I'm 
definitely go for it. Okay, that's okay. Alright, we're gonna like aim the fight between these three tentacles. That's our goal here. Yeah, I'm hoping he's gonna run at me. That's a baddie. The he is bad because he gets the move speed from teleport, right? So it's really easy for him to dodge. It's really unlikely that it'll hit land. Okay, I'm gonna defend this tentacle. You kinda see already we're like we don't have much mana to play around with. Which is why I like mana to these kind of matchups, but he did get Sheen first, so he's gonna have more damage, but less like uh, tankiness, which is kind of nice actually. I'd rather be a little bit squishier. I want a town call. I think I'm almost certain Volley Bear is gonna be top good soon. You're propping him. Yeah, I mean he's playing this like really different from the way he has been. Okay, back off. Let's have flashback up. I do want as much mana as I can get, because we are very low on them. Okay, let's see where Volley Bear is. Yeah, let's just reset here. We're missing more ease than usual. That's okay. Reset, get this. I'm gonna get another long sword. I don't think I really need boots too much. I really need some damage. Oh, I could have gotten Sapphire Crystal too. Felt more, just had more mana on me. That probably would have been good. Oh, that was way too early of a sun, but yeah, see, was, you should have held the sun for afterwards. Um, you just gotta light his CCs better. I am a teacher. Is what of you learn. As you can see, like a lot of your like ability to generate leads depends on your ability to land ease. Like you see Volibear going mid, and he's probably gonna go to bot side after that. Now one thing to think about, so I've been going Oom easy, pretty easily, but one way you can think about like mana, you can either build like mana directly, or you can build more damage. Because like so let's say you damage makes your mana more efficient inherently. Because your abilities do more, right? So you have you should have to spend like less mana on abilities. I'm not gonna ult here, obviously, because he'll just run away. No, why not heal? Oh, he's thinking. Oh, um, that's fine. Good, my dude. That's right. I'll just kill him here under turn. If I can just get like one tentacle on here, I can dirty dive him pretty easily. Oh no. Uh, sad. It sucks. I don't know where Volibear is. Oh, Volibear's mid. I'm gonna say one more. I know he doesn't have teleport. I demolish my backup, backup soon too. Oh, he's safe. Wow. Gotta check those summoner spells, guys, because of unsealed spells. Like... This is um, not pretty. Hey, we have Black Cleaver, so we can actually like kill people now. That's my big beef with this, like, with, like, that's why I like Mandamine a little bit here. This game, it would have been kind of nice, because, like, I just now came online. I could have had kill potential, like, add Pickaxe, like, that extra, like, 10 damage between Phage and Pickaxe is actually pretty, pretty important. Okay, just walking our way back. We have a lot of kill potential now. I wish Volibear would gank me, but not not feeling up to it, I guess. Only wants to kill me at level two and three.
It's been a little bit more chill for him than I would have preferred it to be. Dude, can't hit this guy. You have to be really careful if you miss these, because he could just run at you. I mean, he has Ignite right now. It's like pretty spooky, honestly. Missing any, he'll just run at you and just bop you to death. This is why it's sometimes easier to 1v2 than it is to 1v1. 1v1s, they just kind of run away all the time. 1v2s, you can actually start popping them. I'll commit. One might eat here. Thank you. Lord. Okay, we see Volibear as that dragon. Yep. Alright, we can get first turret here. Oh no. We're slowly winning, though. This is one of those lines where it's like we're not winning off of like kills, but we're definitely winning off of uh, attrition basically. Winning on CS. We have all plates, we got first turret. Yeah. Now unfortunately our team is not doing too well, but Hmm, stun, magic damage. Yeah, there's so much of like all kinds of damage actually. I'm not entirely sure which ones to go. Items to go. For. I'm gonna sell this. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go frozen gauntlet. You can go frozen hard or frozen gauntlet here. I'm gonna go frozen gauntlet just for the slow. I think getting on top of people might be more important. Is Nasus one off his stacks? I mean, Nasus is just going to stack. Like I don't. I don't know. I don't know what people expect me to tell them when they're concerned about it all you can do is like just try to kill him like try to like get more gold than he does to the point where you can like kill him all right we only focus on like what we can control bye bye god you're so aged That was really good. Nice. Oh, I brought my knife. Getting destroyed. I'm so far behind here. Dang it, Jim. Maybe with the Zeras aerial support. He's probably just gonna run it down. Yeah. Eh, they got him. Eh. Alright, that's fine. I'll push for its top bot tier one. He was not giving me anything there. Okay. Should we get this start pretty quickly? The reason I'd rather push here than to like try to recall top and defend their like the top tier one is it's a little bit more efficient movement wise for our team to rotate up there and like to handle it. I'm not sure if they're going to. It looks like our Zerath is running mid. But 
We could be here. Volleybear. Volleybear's missing. Diana's was mid, but just left. Jin could run down. Bard could run down. Basically, landy on whoever. Okay, Volleybear is not here. Bard's not here. We just see him on the map, so this is pure freedom. Nice. We're gonna have a lot of gold here. Lots of, lots of, lots of gold. All the gold! The fact that he ran towards that little gap means he had no way to like sidestep really. If I land one more E, I could get him. Oh, I thought I was out of range. Ooh, he is not having a good time of it. I don't have teleport, so this fighting I don't really care about. Like, if it goes well, cool. If it goes poorly, like that sucks. But it would be so inefficient to run all the way up there, especially drag spawning soon. I'm better off just like just keep pushing, just keep getting gold. Keep killing the minions. It's definitely winnable. It was never not winnable, my friends. It may have felt that way, but... Cool. Worth it over. Let's take all the jungle. Anything? Okay, we can take this. And then we have a lot of gold. <laughs> We're definitely resetting soon. Ward. We're very efficient on our pathing right now. It's really nice. Clear this. I really need to reset the holy moly. There's some high gold per minute like pathing though. If I really wanted to keep like if I were going for like max GPM baby, I'd be like right here right now. I'd be taking these two. I could also go Trinity Force instead of Gauntlet. I've been considering that more and more, more lately. But I won't do it right now. I'm gonna keep going this like really tanky build. This is a build I've been showing y'all lately. Kind of using Transcendence to get a lot of AD while still being tanky. I mean, we're almost double Nasus' CS. It's pretty good considering like we weren't really landing too many E's for a while in lane. I'm gonna go get the red, I'm gonna push bot in. It should probably be top. But our bot lane was already top side, so I didn't want to go up there. Because then the path is inefficient for them. Be mad. Where, where is you are going for efficiency? Although, that thought of mid lane. I'm just going to push. We're hard committed to this now. The idea is that like by the time I rotate, it's probably too far gone, this fight. They're gonna get banned though, but I'll trade for an inhibitor. When I'm splitting bot and we know they have like the numbers there, then they just need to get back, like just sit back and wait. Cause I'll get free inhib as long as they don't get caught anywhere. That's like the perfect macro. I kind of should have expected my team wouldn't play that well. Uh, it's not like that. It's more likely they misplay the situation than play it correctly, I feel like. So I probably should have been there just because. It's one of those things where, like, the perfect play isn't exactly perfect because your teammates aren't going to play perfectly. I actually end up getting them off Baron, though, with that push. That kind of comes down to, like, just being, like, um. Uh, it comes down to, like, even though my team misplayed, I made, like, the right decision, which is I committed. I didn't, like, I didn't go, oh, maybe I should have rotated. Oh, God. Oh, gosh, they lost. Oh, the Baron. Oh, man. Oh, geez. Oh, and then, like, you end up walking through here, like, 18 million times, right? And, like, you waste all this time. You're, like, way better off if you just make, like, a, a decisive decision and just commit to it. Even if it ends up being the wrong decision... Like, commit to it, and then next time, like, look at it. Like, go back and watch and be like, all right, was that actually a good idea? Was that a bad idea? If it wasn't, then, like, try to think about that next time. But don't be indecisive in the game. Like, be decisive. Even if it's wrong. I think it's better to be decisively wrong than to indecisively, like, meh. <laughs> if that makes sense.
Well, I wish uh, Leak showed gold per minute. I'm really curious what mine would be at right now. I'm pretty sure it's really high this game. Like, higher, really high compared to what I'm normally on. I'm gonna push one more back. Okay. Obviously, we're not FFing. I'm gonna go Death Sands here. Do I have the gold for it? Man, I'm really close. Break. Play to drag. Yeah, this is fine. I'll go top. I'll teleport. There we go. We'll even communicate a little bit. Kind of speedy. It's okay. We can we can four v five it. It's not a big deal. Okay. I do have death sands, but it's really awkward for me to back right now. I should back like right as dragon spawning, and if they're gonna contest, I should just get a quick teleport off. Because I have Baron recall, I'll just be there. Off my, uh, I can't. I'm so slow, dude. I'm gonna help. Let's get this. Some of those things are like she's dead. I don't think we can really chase the bard too well. We should probably just push men. Bots getting pushed in. That's really good. Yeah, this is good. We can get mid in heavy. I thought Nasus was gonna all on me, but I should have known better. That like you go for Ash, right? I tried to buy a bottle, but it didn't work. Not a bottle, but a potion. Okay. This is fine. No way! Holy moly, this Lulu is an absolute legend. Wait, where is Lulu? I'm nothing. This Lulu? Holy moly. I cannot believe this Lulu. Oh, oh my god. I'm in love. This Lulu. Yo. Like and subscribe if that was a game. God dang.